Soul Calibur 3. Alright, welcome to the new playthrough. I'm actually gonna record this just in case I don't do a video of it. Anyway. Well, so yeah, welcome to a new playthrough of Soul Calibur 3. <laughs> this is my favorite of the entry. Check this out. Nemco. Oh yeah, I'm actually gonna be playing this with my fight stick. So caliber. Because I have it three. set on the fight stick controls. So let's just do this. Welcome so, to yeah. the new stage of history. That's right, new stage of history. We've got a bunch of modes to pick from. This started off having multiple modes, so not only do we got uh, one but two story modes, one uh, Tales of Souls, which is, which is pretty much just a choose your own adventure with the main cast. And Chronicles of the Sword, which uh, we'll be playing through is, is where it's a mix of a strategy game with the Soul Calibur gameplay. However, it's it stars your custom character that you make, which by the way, I'm show off. Yeah, I know I got a bunch of custom characters, but yeah. So yeah, this is the one game that introduced the custom characters right here. I mean, this is the guy from the teaser. So yeah, I made a bunch of custom characters, just for the heck of it. I purposely made her into like those Gria units in Final Fantasy Tactics A2. And a black man. So yeah, we're gonna do some practice first and then we will start the playthrough. So now the reason why I'm doing this is awesome. Now, the reason why I'm whipping out Zosmo first is because... Versus time to die. Now, the reason why I'm... Battle. Oh. Fight. Oh god, this stage gives me PTSD from fighting Seska. Anyway... So yeah, the reason why I'm showing off these two is because... The character that I'm gonna be using it uses these two movesets, Sosalamels and Talon's moveset, so I gotta be I gotta get used to them, so Sosalamel is easy because he's my main in this game. I know all this stuff. Oh, that didn't save. Thought I had it saved. Probably didn't hear me. Oh yeah. There we go. And set to that. So. A B K. Guard. Okay. There we go. Ring out. <laughs> Fight. Oh yeah. I was doing a bit of practice off stream, like hours before this. Those are some interesting moves. Not this. Oh! What are you doing, Zoss? One move that was really neat. I think it's A, so. Ah, yes, this one. Back A, B, so. There we go. 
Just getting close enough to your opponents. It's oh no, you got me on the pinch. Now nah, you're in a pinch. Oh! Battle. Fight. But yeah. The reason why I'm doing it, this is because I played enough JRPGs and playthroughs, so I figured this would be a good start. See? Like that. Battle. Anyway, yeah. Fight. After after two months of consecutive parts in Final Fantasy Tactics, I thought this would be a, this would be a very good palette cleanser. Plus, I've been wanting to do this for quite a while. So I'm gonna stay away from JRPGs for quite a while. I'm gonna go for more action. And I promised Gavin and Jimmy that we'll do another Borderlands playthrough after this. That we're doing Borderlands 2 after this. Oh, yeah. Don't worry, there won't be consecutive parts like the last one, because it's not as long as Final Fantasy Tactics. Next, I'll flip out Column just to get used to him. I mean, to her. Oh, whoops! Then I'm gonna battle, practice, fight. That's the one move that I know when playing Talon. Like this combo right here. You actually have to press it three times. I used to do it. Like input. Yeah. I'm mostly gonna be using Zosselmo's moves. Now the reason why I'm saying this is because. I don't want to go back to doing this entirely by scratch because there's like way too many stuff to unlock in Soul Calibur 3. Like way, way Soul too much stuff Calibur to unlock. And I know there's like... I, I did it before on my Soul Calibur 2 playthrough, but that was easy compared... Like unlocking stuff was simple compared to this. This, well, the reason why I'm not doing it from scratch and I'm keeping this save file is because one... I like to have things, everything unlocked. And two... Look at all these events that you have to unlock when playing Tales of Souls and all this other stuff. I got this save file from GameFAQs. Look at this. This is... You have to experience all of these in Tales of Souls, so you gotta go through multiple playthroughs. Which ain't a like, fun time when playing through Tales of Souls, cause, uh, Tales of Souls is really tough. It's really difficult, so. Chronicles of the Sword, not as hard as Tales of Souls, but unless if it's, like, certain fights that I'll remember, so. I played through this many times, like, played it a bunch of times. So, we're gonna go through this, we're gonna stop yapping, and we're gonna start smacking. Chronicles of the Sword. I'm gonna do new game. Create the main character of this story. In addition to the main character, you could create other characters, especially for Chronicles of the Sword mode. The number of characters that could be created for this mode is the same as the character creation mode. So yeah, I'm gonna go this. This is the character job, so this is their jobs. Like depending, like they have a total of five weapons to use each of these, each of these jobs. Except Swordmaster, they get in all the default weapons, but no, but no soul of someone. So I'm gonna go through all of these. So Barbarian, they use those Astroth and Nightmares move set. Monk, Maxi and Keelik, Thief, Tira and Yunsung, Dancer, Shangwa and Valdo, Saint. Sosol and Alan Talim, who I'll be using. Ninja, Taki and Setsuka. Gladiator, Rock and Songmina. Pirate, Cervantes and Ivy. Sage, Cassandra and Sophitia. Assassin, Tira again and Lizardman. Knight, Siegfried and Raphael. And Samurai, Mitsurugi and Yoshimitsu. Swordmaster, surprisingly no one, not even 
Soul of Okadan. Since he's the Moku Jin of this character, so we're gonna go with Saint. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Doesn't look that good to me. So, uh, if I do a video of this, I'm gonna do some video editing magic, so I'll go. Do like a spin. Whoa! Yeah, I'm definitely gonna do a video of this. Chronicles of the Sword revisited. And I'll commence the editing. Oh yeah, when you go through Chronicles of the Sword, you, you unlock extra armor parts that you buy from the shop. Which you can unlock other variants of the jobs. Some of them look goofy and some of them look decent. Goofy as in... Okay, uh, why? And the cool is... Uh, which one? Uh, why a cool looking... That was pretty, but this one, look at this. Mmm. The assassin. I want some of that purple stuff. Cult leader and pale. Got food poisoning. Oh, we're gonna. Let's see. Uh, Actually, I use this guy. No, not him. Not burnt face man. I use this guy as a base. But bring it back. Wait, we're saints too. The biker face. Also, one thing that like kind of irks me about this, like everyone, like the default lips on the guys are always like brown, like super brown. So I always, always. Put it back to like the skin color. This is the closest to having skin color. Now I'm gonna make my guy. So, so I'm gonna start with the face. I also have a reference sheet just in case. Shorter beard. There we go. Now normally he would kill you. Now normally this guy would kill you if you see his face. Now, where is it? I think it's this guy. There we go. And now. Where is it? Where is it? Oh yeah, there's two ninja hoods. There's this and is that one. Boom! There we go. What's that? Over toast throw. I just... Sometimes I give him a tattoo, just in case. Oh yeah, I do give him a tattoo, so... Bishop's Guard. He's already wearing that. Lord's Armor, where is that? Lord's Armor. I'm just going back and forth. I got it. And I changed. Yeah, throughout the years, I changed this guy's design from time to time. Sometimes I forget, sometimes I don't. Yeah, this one. Oh yeah, depending on the clothes, but uh, well, your character has a certain alignment, so. so. Right here, Barbarian, like when the, when both of these two markers on the top and, and bottom markers are in, at like the end, like the left, that means they have the fire, which means they have like a fiery personality, like, yeah, let's do this! However, 
if what if the top is on the right and the bottom's on the left, they have this douchebag personality like What do you want, you bastard? You want to die that badly? And the third personality, the opposite of what I said before, is the goody go two shoes personality. I prefer not to do this, but uh I guess I'll fight you anyway. And the last, obviously, the most sinister. Yeah, when both of the markers are on the right, that means they're evil. You will die. Or, in this case, death is waiting for you. So yeah, he's definitely gonna be in the left. But yeah, he's in a fiery, hot personality. Basically, the good guy personality. Got that one enchanted, and where's fish? Fishkin boots. There we go. I used to... I did give him, like, a full... Like, when I first created him... What? I, I... What did I do? Yeah. I used this entire set, like, he went full knight. But then I decided to go light on his armor. Oh, there we go. Just looking up my cheat sheets. Oh yeah, most of them are at two. Because the guy's name is Chaz Red, by the way. Just a little heads up. Okay, so. His color scheme is simple, so I have him as red and gray. Red and gray, red and gray. Ah, uh, yeah. Go with 25, that's a little off. reference oh, waste matter oh he's got black pants Shins don't really matter. Sockies don't really matter. By the way, this customization theme never gets old. Love this track. Okay, yep. He is looking good, looking good. Oh, by the way. I'm itching for a fight. Nope. Come on, come and get me. Nope. You are not worthy to challenge me. Yes. Don't get cocky. You are not. Alright, so. Oh, whoops. Chas Ray. There we go, buddy. Oh, I forgot. the video editing. And there we go. There we go. There we go. Oh, oh yeah. This is another tale of souls and swords. Once there existed on a great continent three countries, the Grandal Empire, the Kingdom of Dalkia, and the Haltis Republic. The Kingdom of Dalkia and the Haltis Republic waged a great war against one another for countless years. The Grandal Empire stayed out of the conflict, amassing their army quietly. 
In a time when King Chester, the great tactician and instigator of the war which later came to be known as the Mantis War, had not yet appeared in the annals of history. The key figure in the war was a mere cadet of the Grand Ole Army. The Art of War Two opposing swords of the foreign origin, with no knowledge of their true powers, man worshipped the swords as a symbol of wealth and authority. Nations destroyed each other over the swords and countless wars have been waged. Blind, reason to, blind, blind to reason or justice, once again, man learns the art of war. And in time, he too will learn. Chastred, are you listening? Chastred, honestly, get your shit together. General Girardeau is already here. Is everyone here? All right then, I'm going to teach you baby birds what it means to be a commander. Those who command on the battlefield must issue a variety of instructions to their forces. In battle, your lives are on the line. It, a mistaken command could lead to the annihilation of your forces. You carry the lives of your companions on your shoulders. Don't take this lightly. In Chronicles of the Sword, the objective is to take over the enemy strongholds while fighting enemy units encountered on the field map. Give orders to the allied units and use them to advance on the enemy strongholds. Conditions for victory. If the conditions for victory in a particular chronicle including taking over the enemy's main stronghold, then once that objective is completed, the player wins, regardless of whether all the enemies, all the enemy units have been destroyed. On the other hand, if the... Yeah, yeah, blah, 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 blah. Conditions for defeat. Once you lose your main stronghold or the enemy or all your allied units are rather inca incapacitated, you are defeated. You will be defeated if any one of these conditions of defeat are met. Note that conditions of defeat will carry in each chronicle, and some will include special conditions. Oh my god, look, look how fast that scrolls. So yeah, all you do is take that, take strongholds, defeat, yeah, occupy the enemy's main stronghold, allies units destroyed. So yeah, here is this. So now we are at level 1 infantry. Oh no. Oh no, he is not using that. He is not using that shit. No, wait, 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 wait. No, no, no. So yeah. You're de- You're- So yeah, you start off with these default weapons. They're not good. They don't have good move sets. Only few of them have good move sets, like the nunchucker. Oh my god, I used to spare that an A B move all the time, especially here. Don't don't get up. Don't don't get up. That's like one of the very few good move sets to use. The Chinese sword Huang. So yeah, As, but the rest of them no. I'm gonna go with Zosla now. As you can see, I have all the weapons unlocked, so I'm gonna go with... But yeah, I'm gonna use Zosomel's primary weapon. There we go, much better. Oh yeah, I have an ally already. Oh my god, his lips! They're pink! Oh! Oh yeah, you could also edit. Oh yeah, you could also not only edit your your character, but also edit the other characters. Oh yeah, there's also a slot, an extra slot, just in case if you want to add more extra characters. I'm not gonna do that because I'm fine. I'm actually cool with the default guys. Don't mind trying them out. Oh yeah, he's the Lance. Lance is not that bad. Compared to the others, oh, yeah. I'll equip him. Pretty. 
Oh yeah, you can also change each unit types. Cavalry, he has the fastest, but they attack the weakest when it comes to strongholds. Infantry is basically the default, like middle. Knight, Knight is the uh, bulkiest, but the slowest. Bandit is the uh, strongest physically, for, but is the is like a glass cannon. They are the opposite of the knight. I always use bandit because they get there fast enough. They're not as fast as cavalry, but they hit hard. So I prefer. I definitely prefer that. I used to have everyone as cavalry until I went to a certain chronicle and I had to switch to bandit, and that's how I won that chronicle. So I use Bandit all the time. So yeah. Oh yeah, there's also the shops, which you can get. Welcome to my store. I already have everything unlocked because of a save file, but yeah. This is where you get all of this stuff. Yeah, this is where you buy all the armor, just for cosmetics. Doesn't really do anything. Weapons you get as well. Hi there. You for Same deal. Swords. Swords, knives, all arms. Nunchucks or dual. And special, I think. You looking for something? Oh yeah. That's what they say when you, uh, like, select that, uh, uh, you select a bunch of times, like, just buy something already! Let's see what... Can I help you find something? Uh. I bought everything, sweetie cakes! And now for the item shop, it's basically unlocking other modes and concept art and all this stuff. For anything in particular. As you can see, she is quite a dish. Uh-uh. Oh! Okay, okay! Alright, alright, um... Okay, I'll, I'll, I'll just leave your store. Yeah, I'll come again. All right, we good? There we good. So yeah, you select your units, put it in these positions. All right, there we go. All right, I'll start off by telling you all about the different commands you can give your soldiers. Hey, I'm supposed to be. He given instructions. Shut up, bitch. Anyway, open the unit menu by placing the cursor on the unit by pressing a confirm button. The unit menu has following instructions. Move. Ex Self-explanatory. Battle. Fight each other. Equip. Change the stuff. Fortify. Fortifies the stronghold where a unit is stationed. Close. Uh, duh. Oh yeah. You zoom in, zoom out. That does not look like my character. Oh, by the way, this is real time. So you gotta act fast. There, yeah, this is stronghold. Oh yeah, you. Yeah, your new unit. You can move them in. Yeah, I know. So I'm gonna move Chaz Red to here. I know it looks slow. I know he it doesn't look like he's moving fast, but he he is fa he is one of the second he's the second fastest. So now I'm gonna attack this stronghold. I'm gonna have Enus go to here. Split up. 
Oh yeah. Most of the time, enemies will stick around these strongholds. So if you try to take over for a stronghold, you go into battle. But sometimes, these guys will chase you down. They will just chase you and then go after your units. They have the... They go through like an animation, whether you let them, but if you select them, you'll be able to battle them to like one on one, traditionally. Decisive battle. All right, here we go. The Almighty Ones have granted you a sword to cut your own path. It's too late to cower in fear. Ah! Final battle fight. First effect poison already. Get out of here. You picked the wrong person to fight. But yeah, you can level up and your stats increase depending on how well you do. De depending on your job as well. Ah! Ah! Yeah, no kidding. Wait, I want to explain things. There we go. This stronghold is now under our control. Did you notice though that your health was decreasing steadily while you were fighting? Some strongholds are equipped with such special effects. There are various effects you can use to use your advantage during your battles. Oh, not this guy again. If an ally unit is stationed inside a stronghold, you can select Fortify in the unit menu to increase the level of that stronghold. Raising a level of the stronghold will increase its durability against enemy attacks. That comes in handy later if you need to defend. However, fortifying strongholds require gold. Oh yeah, it, it costs money. Good thing I got a shitload of cash. Thank you, save file. If your main stronghold as well as the allies strongholds at level 3, they can be used as revive points. An incapacitated unit with zero health can go to a revive point and regain its health. Once the unit is incapacitated, it will draw temporarily from the field map. Once the revive gaze is on the screen and becomes full, the unit will be stationed at the nearest revive point and will be active again. Now we're gonna get him inside, take a nice rest. Well, Anus? <laughs> I can't stop saying his name wrongly. How do I pronounce his name correctly without having it this sound like Anus? Now two souls are fiercely entangled. Let's settle this! Aeneas. Alright. Settle this. Oh, they got the same voice. Final battle fight. <laughs> yep, Helix move and Swan Minus move. Be careful from now on. He didn't even... Oh. It took a little bit little bit of damage. There we go. I'm gonna get that stronghold just in case. He's good enough. I don't need to... I don't need to increase the strength of the wood. I don't need to, to bulk this up. Because it's the first one. I'm gonna give him a head start. Drop to that cavalry. When friendly and enemy units collide, they begin to skirmish on that spot and reduce each other's health. You can still issue orders to a unit that is engaged with the enemy. It's up to you whether that unit gets to really show what it can do. I usually manually do battles that way. I just straight up do battles.
Now, sometimes they'll take a lot more damage when they do it automatically. There are exceptions, though. Two heroes finally meet under the star of destiny. I'm itching for a fight. This is gonna be great. Oh, mirror match. Final battle. Fight. Lance versus Lance. <laughs> Boom, easy. Don't hold back next time. Decisive battle. Another one. to arrange their battle. It's too late to cower in fear. Get out of my way! Final battle, fight! That's the one thing my characters say often. Get out of my way! You're in my way! Ah, stupid poison. You are not worthy to challenge. Oh, perfect line for that win pose. Yeah, rest up. Anyway, we rested up. Dude's using a great sword. <laughs> what are you doing? Uh, I don't know. Trust your noble soul this is a unique stage. Sword. You can't even select it unless if it's the, the first is special. Let's settle this. Final battle fight. You picked the wrong person to fight. Damn straight, buddy. He's not that damaged anyway. Yeah, I'm gonna have both units take down this castle. This is the main building that you gotta take down. about them games, huh? Couldn't time for me to sip my water. Decisive battle. There's just gonna be various granol units. This is your last chance to mend your ways. Please get out of my way. Uh, another one that says get out of my way. You could do a Soul Calibur 3 vocabulary. Oh my god, that completely missed. <clears throat> Accept your challenge anytime. Oh, yeah, if you hold one of the attack buttons. 
when doing a win pose. I think it was mostly on the default movesets. I'm gonna hold it. Take this opportunity to purify your soul. There we go, they have a unique line, depending on the job you use on your character. You've neutralized the enemy's main stronghold. Well done. With that, you've learned so far. With that you've learned so far, you baby birds should at least be able to fly a little on your own. I've taught you all I have to teach for now. This concludes your tactical training. Hey, don't forget about me! The tutorial voice! Shut up. There we go. Aeneas? Aeneas? Aeneas. Oh, more than one perfect. Oh yeah, you get a bonus by completing these assessments. What? I'm filthy fucking rich, baby! By the way, that was the other person's save file. And there was my previous save file. I did this save file back on my second channel where I was showing showcasing all these these cutscenes. Gonna overwrite overwrite this. There we go. Chronicle one, day by day. For what purpose? For whose sake men raise swords against one another? Chastred stood amongst the officer Caddis that had lined up to the booming, the booming voice of their instructor, General Girardeau. General... Let me read this again, sorry I messed up. Chastred stood amongst the officer Caddis that had lined up to the booming voice of their instructor, General Girardeau. The practice battle will now begin. The face-off would be t between Abelia, the sharpest woman at the academy, and Chastred, who would be taking in command of the, of the unit f for the first time. Don't worry, since this is only practice, we'll let you keep your lives when you lose. Just practice? No. If Chastred lost on the battlefield, there would be no tomorrow for him. Defeat was not an option. I don't care if we're up against Abelia, I refuse to lose, you got that? Well then that's the deal, alright? Occupy the enemy's main stronghold. Loss of your main stronghold and all ally units destroyed. Good luck, buddy boy! So now we got... Race. Race. Oh yeah, she uses the wave sword. This is this is also a revenant's weapon. I'm gonna make her use revenant's weapon because it looks better than you know this boring looking weapon. Obviously, Chastred has to be there. I mean, why wouldn't I have the main character? Unit type. She fits more bandits than the guy, so I'm gonna make him an infantry. One, two, three, let's. Uh, uh, I'm gonna make him go to two. Well. This guy would go on one. Yeah. There we go. Move out! Show them what you're made of! So yeah, it's the same map as before. So yeah, all the enemy units are moving at the same time, so it's like a real-time strategy game. You gotta get your units to move their ass. <laughs> I 
And let's do it. She can handle these guys. I think I made it before the other guy did it. The Almighty. Please get out of my way. Let's settle this. Final battle. Ah, good. Only one. Stop whining! I won't hold back next time. Right, you need a rest. Didn't think you would take that much of a beating. They have Zosso Mouse win pose. Eh. Gotta have Anus have it. <laughs> I keep giving him his wrong name. Ah, fuck it, I'll try it. I think she recovered enough energy. I think. Final battle. Oh no, the anime boy face. Notice. Oh. What? I can't believe this. Ah, first loss. I gotta wait for her to revive. Don't spread out your forces. Concentrate your attacks on one target at a time. I'm gonna get you, pretty boy. Two, I will never heal for the likes of you. Get out of my way! Oh yeah, the, the Grieve Edge is, looks pretty cool. I borrow some moves from the Tekken games. You picked the wrong person to fight. If you excuse me, I gotta. Repair my building right here. No, wait, 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 wait. What if I... There we go. That recover. Main guy. Be fine. And a race would be back. There we go. She's back. They're ready to rumble. Oh yeah, it heals on its own.
decisive battle. Three against one. What's it gonna be, baby? Now two souls are fiercely entangled. It's too late to cower in fear. Are you sure you want to do this? Yes. Battle one. Fight. Ah. Ah. Oh no you don't. By the way, you can't tag out during battle. It's like King of Fighters. Did the pain set it yet? I think I'll let my buddy Chaz Red heal up. difference in healing when you're inside. Right, it's halfway healed. So let me heal some more. Almost. Almost. Doing this because. There we go. All units, attack the main fort. All units, attack the main stronghold. I said attack the main stronghold. Finding Abelia. Well, well, I'll be happy to be your opponent. Decisive battle. Let's do this, shiz. Good luck to you. Fight with all your might as I will. Battle one. Fight. Here we go. Three against one. Oh! <laughs> Boom. Easy. You picked the wrong person. Level up. Don't get full of yourself. <laughs> this is just practice. <laughs> Motherfucker! Were my tactics not good enough? Chronicle clear. There we go, got my refund. We got a race. There 
go. Leaving the nest. The final test. A test to command ability under the real battlefield conditions was about to begin. This is the last time I get to play with you baby birds. That's right. This is your final test. Don't expect me to go easy on you. The general is about to be his opponent? Depending on his performance, Chastran might even be entrusted with troops to lead to the into the field. If he failed, he would never see battle. That would be his, that would be the safe route, but it would mean denying the very reason he was here. Today, this baby bird will leave his cage, step onto the battlefield with his life in his own hands, and begin to fly. Right, same condition as before. They're gonna be using different weapons that have effects. So I'm gonna start using certain weapons. I'm gonna go for. Uh, let's see. It doesn't show. Just the symbols. I think that one guard breaks and that one increases guard impact. That one has more pushback, more range. All the heals. Not gonna be using this until much later. Not gonna be using this at all. They're joke weapons. There's the Ancient. You know what irks me? Even though this is my favorite game in this series, they don't, they have the nerve to put like the player one and player two weapons in there. There's three other weapons, one legendary, one joke weapon, and then the Ancient. These two are a waste of slots. I feel. Should have been a different weapon with another effect, and this should have been another weapon. Like, these two should have shared the same slot. But that's just a nitpick I have. So yeah, I'm gonna go with Balor. The guy that I can't pronounce. More damage. Impact. More pushback. Gain is more attack the, the longer you last. That I quit. Mantis blade pierces, like breaks shields, more defense, more attack, heals, but put but pushes you back. I think so. Gonna break some defense. Sorty, sorty. Same units as before. Yeah, so... Be cool. Show these baby birds what a real army is like. I'm gonna have you fortify this just in case. Oh no, you don't. Oh no, you don't, buddy. Actually, I should have made Anus go to... Over the <laughs> oh my god, I can't stop calling him Anus. Their fury. The other guy go to the bottom. I shall give you a proper burial. Hey, this guy's got the same facial features as my guy. The same face. Oh! You pick 
picked the wrong person to fight. Motherfucker. Oh god! Oh! Hey, hey, red lips. Downstairs. Oh, Jinkai. Jinkai, he appears in multiple chronicles. Fate conspired to arrange. All right, let's settle this. Nice looking blades. You just don't give up, do you? Battle one, fight. <laughs> He didn't even stand a chance. It looks like I'm just too strong for you. Oh, I couldn't touch her. Oh god! Oh god! Oh fuck! We gotta get out of here! Jared will help us! Wait, well, what are you doing? What are you doing? I'm getting the hell out of here! That's what I'm doing! Oh, you stupid baby birds. You too. Move ahead. Well, Chaz Red takes a nice nap. Alright, he's back from his nap. What are you doing? Stop them! Fuck that shit! Sometimes they pop out of the stronghold. Right, Chaz Red, you're gonna need backup. Ooh, defense down. Mess up the castle. Oh yeah, you, you can switch weapons during the battle. One way sword, radius. Here we go. Not bad, but you not bad, but you won't be rid of me that easily. Decisive battle. Let me decide that. You are strong. One day, you will succeed in life. Of course, only if you manage to defeat me. Battle one. All right. Fight. Oh. My bodies will, my bodies will do it. This is gonna be great. 
Battle 2, fight! <laughs> Can't penetrate this defense. It looks like I'm just too strong. Level up. Yeah. Alright, that's all you have to say. Even the race has something to say when she uses dual blades. You still get experience even after you lose. Let's settle this. Battle four. Fight. <laughs> Using the same weapon as Gyrido. Same move set as Abelia. Oh, I better be careful here. Oh, that was close. Don't hold back next time. Yeah. Oh, come on, I didn't level up. That's not right. Whoa. I'm retreating. So am I. I'm not a pussy. Not too bad. That was more than enough to pass. That was close. Oh, I didn't unlock anyone yet. Go with that. Live by the sword. Jastrat has graduated from the academy. He was now a commander. He and his comrades swore allegiance to their country and to one another. That would be their bond. Jastrat was entrusted with a border garrison. He would be the wall. He would be the wall that protected his country. Now that he has now that he had become an officer in the military, he stopped to reflect on himself. Was it... Was it he truly wanted to protect? What was it... Oh, I'm reading this badly. What was it he truly wanted to protect? His home? A peaceful life? The ones he loved? Or... We received information that a group of what appear to be a brigade... Brigands have been sighted near the border. Find and capture them. The atmosphere, the atmosphere changed instantly, and the tension spread. Chasred steeled himself for his first real battle. Uh, what voice do I give him? What voice do I give him? Uh, oh, Loki. Grand old forces are coming from the east. Well, well, a new enemy to play with for a while. We have to capture the enemy quickly. It's going to be a difficult. It's going to be difficult with this low visibility. Don't worry. This should be. This shouldn't be too difficult. By the way, I hear this is your first time in real combat. Look at the way they move. They're no ordinary brigands. Keep your cool and take them out one at a time. Ah, how rude of me. I am Aiga, assigned to be your unit as of today. At your service. Oh 
my god, he's even got red lips as well. Oh no. That used to be Raphael's rapier. Gasson, that's Arthur's. Lower reach. Oh, yeah, the Katanas have very little stuff, so. Now I'm gonna do. Now I'm gonna do Tolem's move sets with Tonfa. Oh, it's not that bad. Oh, I thought it would look worse. Actually, yeah. <laughs> oh my god, look how goofy it. Oh my god. The badass night ninja. What the girly little turn fast. Yeah, I, d I always give my units healing weapons like that. Cause, uh, you saw what Giordo did to me. I'm gonna use him, him, and him. Yeah, these... Yeah, these two would be fine enough. Race? Eh. I always thought the wave blades would look cool, but they don't feel right. They, they don't feel that good to play as. Now I'm gonna switch on over to Tolem's moveset. So now we're up against orange units, so... There's various different colors on enemy units. I'm gonna have him go here. Stay where you are. Oh yeah, unit type. Bandit. There we go. Alright, so... Wait, what is a granola unit doing here? Why are they on an enemy team? Done with training. Okay, so. There you go, we'll go for the battle. Me. Got Chaz Red in. Chaz Red in A will go. Go from the top, or. Hmm. Oh, help me. Or we can just fight them head on. The fighters, I will never yield to the likes of you. All right, let's settle this. Final battle, fight! <laughs> oh, you got, baby? Oh, you got? You are not worthy to challenge me. Oh, I love my Tonfus. Oh, I love my Tonfus. I'm coming to get you! I'm coming to get you! Alright, now let's check out Arthur's moveset. Arthur's moveset is the katana style. The fighters face a gruesome quest to search for the ultimate sword. Get out of my way! 
Stand a chance. I'm coming to get you. I'm getting you. Oh, I'm gonna get you as well. Decisive battle. Entrust your noble soul in your sword. This is your last chance to mend your ways. All right, let's settle this. Oh, another one. Battle one. You're gonna stand one. a chance and at least hit me? Yeah. Oh! Smack, 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 smack. Did the pain set it yet? Hey there, Revenge. How you doing? I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. Actually, let them line up right there. Yep. I'm gonna start with you. You're gonna lead the fight. Um... It's debatable if it's better or not. Yeah, I, I still think, even though this is my favorite of the Soul Calibur games, I still like Weapon Master a little bit more than this. Because that one's more simple compared to this. Like, it's a neat concept, it really is. It's still, it's still a really good mode. Like, it's one of the two modes to go through. There we go. Nice helicopter move. Yeah. Almost just as good as Weapon Master. Battle 2. Fight! Yeah, that's the main reason. The main reason why Soul Calibur 3 isn't as recognized as the other ones is because it's a PS2 exclusive. This really wasn't a and the previous contest. game was multi-console, so I don't know how it became a PS2 exclusive when it already was multi-console. Yeah. Like this sort of mode, like it kind of, it might throw some people off. Like this sort of mode, like they might not handle like this amount of stress. Decisive battle. Like it depends on what kind of games, other games you like. Like I'm fine with the strategy game, but I, I, some people like it, some people don't. Most people like this. A hero desires a sword, and a sword desires truth. Get out of my way! Yeah, it... Get out of my way! Oh! They both said the same thing. Get out of my way! Get out of my way! You're in my way! No, you're in my way! You're in my way! No, you are in my way! That's the one common thing they say in this game, especially the custom characters. Get out of my way! This really wasn't a fair contest. You shouldn't have been in my way, buddy. He was in my way. Ah! 
I'm gonna let them heal up. Okay, I'm gonna let Shadow Shred go up there. While the other two take care of the unoccupied tower. against that building, that's where it goes. I played a game similar to this called Czar Burn Under the Crown. It was a real-time strategy game. And it, it was pretty neat. Like, I'm not used to real-time strategy games. In fact, I'm pretty bad at them. Like, I couldn't even go through with the easy mode of StarCraft. But Czar was pretty neat. Decisive battle. Can you make a real fire this? Yeah, you can. You can also well, make you multiple Watched multiple custom characters ones, throughout the story, like at any time. This is, your last chance this is the main uh, character that you use. Get out of my way. It was obviously a custom character that I my made. Fight. Earlier, I gave him Zosimos move set. Now he's using Talums because he has the Saint class. Took down that traitor. Oh my god. I never thought my precious ninja knight would be holding as tough as hugging it. So each custom character has a unique job. The saint, like I said, has like the staff, the dagger, and the fan while using Zoslo and Alan Tolum's moveset, which you unlock like, when you level up your character in this mode. Now, take down this main stronghold. Yeah, that's... Yeah, they don't like it as much as the previous three games, unfortunately. Especially Soul Calibur V with this bonkers story. Although they did get it, like, the like player pace did, did give Soul Calibur VI a chance. Like, it was, yeah, it was well received almost as much as Soul Calibur II, VI. It's time you disappeared. Decisive battle. Uh-uh, you don't decide my fate, buddy. Time I disappeared? Mm-mm, no, no. You're the one that should disappear forever. Two heroes finally meet under the star of destiny. This is your last chance to mend your ways. Get out of my way! Battle one, fight! Oh, guard. I'll accept your challenge. My guy won't be able to make it. Yeah, the the weaker they are, the louder they bark. Battle two, fight! Ah. What? I'm itching for a fight! Battle three, fight! I think I... Yeah, that's what I'm wondering as well, what made... It's so polarizing. Four was 
pretty darn good. I replayed four for a while. I actually ended up being surprisingly any better than I thought. Although the customization in Soul Calibur 4 was off, like, really strange. Because it affects your stats. Oh, double KO! Well, oh, <laughs> oh, this guy's face. Absolutely no intention of dying here. <laughs> oh, my God. God, his stubbed toe face was there for a while. And then, oh man. Yeah, that was really a hard beating. Yeah, enemies are very, very tough in this mode. Not as tough as Tales of Souls. Tales of Souls is even harder than this. Like, it's another single-player campaign, which you use... It's basically like a... It's basically... A, like a... Ex, like an extended ladder mode. But it's like a choose-your-own-adventure type. Battlefield Moon. Several days later, the Kingdom of Dalkia suddenly declared war. Claiming to retaliate against an attack by Grand Ole Soldiers. Looks like they want to. Looks like they want to go to a war so badly they'll use any trick they have to justify it. Chasred couldn't believe what his comrade had told him. During the battle they had just fought, Grand Ole Soldiers had spotted mixed in with fleeing brig brigands. In other words, it was a setup. Human greed. Real war a mind-numbing fear of terrible sight to come. Even so, he did not want to lose his future, so for now, he would take up the sword. Or Tonfuss. Or Scythe. What Soul Calibur character I hate the most? Fucking Lizard Man. I hate Lizard Man so goddamn much, he is a pain he has to fight against, and I don't like his fighting style. Especially in this game. I hate fighting against Lizard Man in this game. Oh, when I fight him, when I fight against him in, in Tales of Souls, I almost want to reset just as much as Setska. Setska is even worse difficulty wise, but she has a cool moveset. But Lizard Man? Oh god, no. So I'm gonna give him his healing weapon. Speaking of healing, I need some healing winds. I'm sweating up a storm. Funny thing about Lizard Man in Soul Calibur, Soul Calibur 2, that's not the actual Lizard Man, that's his henchman, the Lizard Man. The real Lizard Man is in Soul Calibur 1, this, 4, and onward. But they use his moveset. Oh yeah, I'm going back to Zosimel's. Which I'm definitely going to give him this weapon. Really good weapon for healing. Yeah, the reason why I don't like... Hey, yeah, like I said, the reason why I don't like Lizard Man is because he's just... He's just another version of Sophitia and Cassandra. Like, he's just another sword and shield fighter. Yes, he's got, like, certain moves that are unique, but he's just... Oh, it's such a pain to fight against. But his henchmen in Soul Calibur 2, they're not as bad as the Lizard Man himself, who's actually named Aeon, by the way. 
Should have called him his real name, Aeon. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, they made him not playable because fuck Lizard Man. Who wants this? Who wants to play as him? Yeah, much. Yeah. Oddly enough, Assassin replaces Huang in Soul Calibur 2. Well, then again, he's replaced by Yun Sung in Soul Calibur 2 as well. So, Huang got replaced by two guys Yun Sung and Assassin. Yeah, they replaced Rock with Berserker as well. Uh, Namco was like, oh, you missed. You missed Huang, you missed Lizardman, you missed. There's Rock as well. Well, here's a character. Here are these characters that have their move sets. Better than nothing. So yeah, I'm cool with these. But now we're up against Dalkia, which are the yellow units. I'm gonna make a oh, three. A would be there. They're inhuman! We won't last much longer like this! Oh shit, reinforcements? Reinfor reinforcements. What perfect timing. This was so easy, I was getting bored. Oh yeah, there's Luna. She's actually one of the more popular characters in this mode. Uh, let's see. Dalkia. Oh yeah, if your main character encounters her, there's a special cutscene that plays. Okay, so I'm gonna have my guys defend these strongholds. You defend this one. See, I'm gonna fortify this. Yeah, Berserker. Oh yeah, Berserkers are annoying to fight against. I remember when I did my Twitch playthrough of that. Yeah, those Berserkers, man. Oh, they're coming full force. The Dalkia units. Actually, you know what? Back up, Chaz Red. Oh wait, Chaz Red is below. Never mind. Ha ha ha! They also have typical Bruce Lee sounds. Show! Whoa! Unleash their fury. Let's settle this. I'm itching for a fight. Battle one. Fight. Stay away from me. Stay away from me. Don't come near me. I'll take you on anytime you want. I'm itching for a fight. You know, Berserker's like, fight. <laughs> 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 bastard. Oh, what a bit nice that he hit the lava. Oh yeah, let's go. Hey! Damn, Lance is pretty good, actually. Battle three, fight. Not like a common. Yeah, sort of like Keelik. Now you commit murder. Hope you're happy. Screw the Geneva Convention then. 
Oh wait, there wasn't a Geneva Convention in the medieval times. Another one that says get out of my way. Nope, nope. Oh, that was close, eh? Be careful from now on. Yeah, that's what I love about it. Like, you just smack it a bunch of times. Ah, 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 ah. Like that. Oh my god, hey! You wiped them all out, buddy! Not even my main man Chasred was able to do that. Okay, so. When your main character battles Luna, there's a unique cutscene. You're certainly a handful. I shall remember your name, as you are the only one who has provided a worthy challenge. Oh my god, her mouth movement. What she was saying is, ah! That's what she was really saying. That's what her lips say. Oh my god, I am so glad I have this weapon. Good thing I made Zasuma now in this game. Ah. I've lost? Bullshit! Ah! Retreat for now! Bye, baby. Oh, look at everyone else. It's like, oh god! Oh my god, no! No! We gotta get out of here! Oh god, no! I'm out of here! Fuck this, I'm out! And Ariane's like doing, What are you fools doing? Get back to the front lines, you pussies! They're too scared of the. Actually, they're more scared of him more than Jazzred. running away from? That ninja knight? No! No, it's the guy with the red lips! Which guy with the red lips? The guy with the lance! Oh! Astaroth! Oh, I forgot! The main roster does show up in some of these battles, but look at their level! Oh! Yeah, that... They're basically like an extended challenge, as if it, the regular enemies aren't hard enough. Like, look at this. 4, 4, 4, 4, 14. Astroth, level 60. Coward. That's how you call someone a pussy in the medieval times, a coward. Okay. Let's take over these strongholds. What are you doing, you cowards? They're going after our strongholds! I don't want to deal with Mr. Red Lips! Where they did you night? You saw what she did- You saw what that guy did to Luna? Oh yeah, we're halfway through. Oh, 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 get back inside. Which 
Actually, I'm gonna... No, I would send all my units to this one, but I don't think I want to. Because if I do that, I'll lose all of my units and I'll lose the battle, so I'm not gonna do that. So I'm gonna take care of this stronghold first. God, they're coming! They're coming! What are you fools doing? Go after them! Look at them! Yeah, pretty much. Higher level, stronger enemies, so I'm gonna... I'm gonna send out A and I'm gonna send out A and Chazred. Oh, get back inside. Yeah, that's the problem <laughs> with this mode. Like, you make him go. Like, you go to this stronghold, and, like, attack. But if you do it like this way, they'll go to it, go to the stronghold, and after they capture it, they move and they go outside when you want them to go inside. Position and Chaz Red, follow him. Fight Astaroth. Just to, just for demonstration purposes. Now if I lose against him, then oh well. Gives me experience regardless if I win or lose. And it is defense down. So I'll end up. So I'll take more damage, naturally. Even in droves, they're still too weak. I'll kill you slowly. Decisive battle. Also, in this mode, oh, the main roster is in their secondary outfit. Two heroes finally meet. It's too late to cower in fear. Oh. I'll strangle the life out of you. Oh, using their Battle player one fight. outfit. Oh my god, that damage. Oh, almost got him. Well, at least I leveled up. Get out of my way. Final battle fight. <laughs> more harder than this. Oh my god. Well, high risk, high reward. <laughs> yeah, I know, right? You've got some guts. For a fool. Sorry, boss. Whatever, have your precious friggin' experience. Right, I'm gonna wait for Chasrid to fully revive. Hey, you will hold your position up there just in case if I lose both guys again. There we go. So Mega and Chaz Red will. And 
want him to go there first. Again, I'm leaving A here just in case. Ooh, Cure Arc. I'm guessing... I'm guessing the enemy has Cure. Actually, both sides would have Cure. Been a while since I played this. Again, the last time I played this was for a video on my secondary channel, which I unknowingly abandoned for quite a while. Huh! How impressive! Let's move out! Alright, stop being cowards and fight these guys already! Oh god! Oh god, please no! Anyone but them! Fate conspired to arrange their battle. I will never heal to the likes of you. Get out of my way! Get away from me! Get away from me! Battle one. Fight! That's a lot of enemies. Oh, I thought so. Well, good thing I have cure. My cure. The weapon that I cannot pronounce. Luckily, there's no timer on these battles. You are not worthy to challenge me. Don't worry, I'll catch up to A's level. Please get out of my way. Battle two. I'm in your way. Really? That's why I have my guy use the man voice. So that he doesn't rely on saying, Get out of my way! You're in my way! You picked the wrong person to fight. Yeah, exactly. All of them are running away from my guys. Let's settle this. Why do you think they're, they're here in the first place? I mean, especially after what I did to Luna. Oh my god, his laying pose. Oh, uh, no, please. Oh, the Grief Edge, the Tekken move set. <laughs> you picked the wrong person to fight. Alright, next up should we the boss man. A futile effort. You don't scare me, buddy. Even though well, you're tall. No wonder my guys are scared of you! You are not worthy to challenge me. Ah, no level up yet. Oh well, you're already level up anyway. Okay, so I'm gonna stop Chronicles of the Sword for now, for tonight, because that's plenty enough. 
and I'll show off other moves. Yeah, really cracked the bone there. Three. But yeah, to the new just for the last 10 minutes, I'm gonna show history. off Soul Arena. Just for the heck of it. We get some additional practice anyway. Versus Sophitia. Her desire to save her children from darkness drives her to battle. This is your last chance to mend your ways. I'm ready to fight you. This is one of those secondary outfits that I Level like better than the primary. Fight. Yeah, the first outfit is easy on the eyes, but I like the design of this better. By the way, this is the same character that they did dirty in the future games. Actually, both players can use their custom characters. And you can get more. You can even use more for the custom characters. You have 10 slots. You actually buy. You start off with five. You actually start off with three slots, and then later on, you buy more slots for extra char custom characters. So in total, you get 10 characters to create. And on the second. The same goes with both the memory cards. So each memory, so both memory cards, you have a total of 20 custom characters to make. You win. You pick the wrong person to fight. Yeah, it is. And this is this started the whole custom character thing in general. Like this carried on throughout the whole series. The winds guide her with visions of the heaven. This is your last chance to mend your ways. I cannot lose this fight. I can't believe I'm using your fighting style, but I have to get used to it. Got that move. <laughs> like, that move right there launches. In the later games, it doesn't launch. Gee, I wonder why. Anyway, as I was saying about Soul Calibur 4, I don't like the customization in Soul Calibur 4 mainly because it affects stats of your character. Like some outfit, like some armor pieces, like drain one stat while it increases the other one, or some do nothing. You can make them look really cool but have really bad stats. You can make them look goofy and have good stats. So pick your poison with this one. Plus, there's. The armor selection is very, very limited, and I'll show you what I mean after this. Yeah. Yeah, Tom's a real nice- Oh, Okadan already! Master Okadan! He's the edge master of this game. One, edge master himself. Two, charade. Three, this guy. Those who get in my way will die! Oh. Battle one. I just fought Talim a battle in battle. You win. Did the pain set it yet? Hoot hoot. Battle two. Oh, Ivy's move set. Thankfully, it's not an online match in Soul Calibur 6. Because I fear Ivy players in Soul Calibur 6 online. Because, oh my god, it's so hard to fight against. Because people are so good with her. She's such a high tier character in that game. The grueling battle ends. You win. You picked the wrong person to fight. Oh, speaking of Ivy, she seeks the sword that may be her only salvation. Yeah, <laughs> pretty much. Especially the custom you. characters. You suck. You were in my way, buddy. This will be fun. You're a fool to get in my way. <laughs> Ah. 
Got hit. You win. Did the pain set it yet? Battle two. Fight. <laughs> God, I'm so awesome in this game. He's my main in this game. Yeah, that grab. Woo! You win. You picked the wrong person to fight. His other grabs are just a savage. Versus Cervantes. Uh, now we're going up against her father, the Cervantes. Seeks the one who threatens its existence. I will never yield to the likes of you. Oh, you mean Ivy's grab? All right. Yeah, Zazu Mel also has pretty savage grabs as well, one, especially fight. one from behind. Cervantes is also another tough enemy to fight against in Tales of Souls. Also, I love his secondary outfit in this game as well. Oh, nice one. Yeah. You lose. No one can stop me. Final battle. Yeah, he looked a lot better when he, when he didn't have that purple and, and bluish skin. Although in Soul Calibur 6 they gave him a glowy skin. Yeah. I also prefer Cervantes' older look as well. Oh damn, I gotta step up my game. Battle one. Fight. Ah. Oh no, you don't. Battle two, fight. Let's go. Ah. Not this time, Cervantes. Yar har. You win. You are not worthy to kick your booty. Versus Tira. Oh, Tira. She wants my body. Embraced by the wings of darkness, emits a piercing scream. It's too late to cower. Hey, I was in the middle of saying my sentence. I can't wait to see you in pieces. Battle one. Fight. <laughs> Yeah, this is also Kira's debut. She's actually not as good as she is right now, like currently. Like her move sets a lot better in the future games. Like the only thing different about Jolly Gloomy is her facial expressions. Yeah, she's a bad bitch. Accept your challenge. 
Anytime. Yeah, that's what she is. Another bad Level bitch. Two. Oh yeah, stage 7 is always going to be a fixed fight, so custom characters with a fire alignment will always fight Nightmare. I'll just show it off again after, after I'm done with quick play and then end it. Also, by the way, the enemies in the quick play the, the AI always uses the second player weapon since it's a separate slot. Nightmare is also a bastard in Tales of Souls. Yeah. Yeah, I'm not a fan of this Nightmare's voice, because he sounds like Marge's sisters. Yeah. His voice was way better in Soul Calibur 2. Like, he sounded more menacing. And here, like I said, he sounds like Marge's sisters. Oh my god! You lose drown in the cesspool of darkness. Oh, man. Oh, man. Give me your soul. Meanwhile, on the contrary, Siegfried's Soul Calibur 3 voices. Perfect. Crispin fucking Freeman as Siegfried. Yeah, yeah, the horn is just over the top. Me, Gavin, and Jimmy we talked about like how kind of big fuck up those horns are. Also, final boss Abyss. He's actually uh, uh in He's actually a powered up version of Zoslo now. I will never yield to the likes of you. Yeah, ironically, his best outfit, Nightmare, doesn't have the horn in his helmet. Meanwhile, the rest of them, they're not as good as the Soul Calibur 2 outfit because of those stupid horns that they insist on giving him. And don't even get me started on Soul Calibur 4 Nightmare's outfits. That, that outfit is just overkill. Oh, by the way, speaking of overkill, this boss is very tough. You win. I'll accept your challenge anytime. Battle two, fight. Yeah, Soul Calibur one I can excuse because it's like it had to go somewhere, but three and beyond they just get... it. Like, how can we make? His outfit better. I oh, I don't know. Just give him the big fuck off horn. Make him horny. You lose. Into your soul. Final battle. Fight. Oh my god. Ow! 
Oh god, it's Kazuya all over again! It's Devil Kazuya all over again! Yeah, this spot! Very tough. Yeah, he is. Yep, typical fighting game fashion. The final boss always gets an upper hand. <laughs> it's a good thing I learned that move recently. Challenge anytime. Battle two. Fight. This is done. You are not worthy to challenge me. Believe it or not, there is another final boss in this game, in Tales of Souls especially, called Night Terror. He's just an even more powerful version of Nightmare. The legend and the way to get it to fight him is very complex. You go through specific paths to like, to get to the Grand Labyrinth to fight Okadan, but at the same time, you can't get KO'd at all. You must not lose, so you go through specific paths to get to Okadan without dying once. And if you mess up, you gotta do it all over again. The only time you're allowed to mess up is the battle with, with Zosanamal, like the second to last battle, and then you fight Night Terror. And when you do fight Night Terror, he destroys you. So yeah, here is the custom character. So I'm gonna I'm gonna delete this guy because I used him for a teaser. So, so yeah, I'm gonna make an example character right here now. I gotta check Pania. She is bonk. Okay. I make I already have the knight. How about I make an assassin? Which voice just voice? <laughs> Actually no. Well Night Terror does not speak at all. Anyway, here is the customizations. So I'm gonna I'm gonna make him look like an edge floor, so. Actually, no. So, yeah. Also, for whatever reason, everyone has brown lips, so I just. Do that, 415. So, yeah, you get all these other options. Now, depending on the clothing, they change their allegiance. So, certain headgear, certain piece of armor changes their personality. So we go with ninja hood, stealth hood, ages hood, hermit's hood, specter hood, which hides their face entirely. Oh, see that? Shogun's helmet. Changed to fire personality. Yeah. 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 Definitely. Yeah. Oh, yeah. King's Mask. Actually, yeah, we're gonna give him King's Mask. Why not? Come on. Yeah. No online. This game does not have online. Uh, where 
percent. Oh, damn it. Oops. Why not? Yeah, they they did apparently. Yeah, even Mortal Kombat Deception, a game a year before this, had online, and it was multi-console. Yeah, I still think this game deserved to be multi-console, even with all the features. Because that way, more people would have given this game more attention than it should. Like I said, I love this game to death. This is my favorite out of the series. It's a shame to see that not many people play it. This game also did have an arcade version which came out after this, and... Yeah, it is improved. It's actually the gameplay is improved in the arcade version. Believe it or not. Wang, the bonus three for the bonus characters: Wang, Li Long, Amy, and Arthur. They became the default playable characters. Also, Yo Red. I'm just finishing up the stream. But don't worry, you can watch the VOD to see the rest of the stream. Oh yeah. Let's change the color. Ooh, how about I give him like an Armor King vibe? Like this. Doesn't matter on the hair, doesn't matter on the chin. Can't go wrong with white plain pants. Come on, come and get me. I'm itching for a fight. Nah. Come on. Yeah, it doesn't really matter, so. Nah. Oh, yeah. I'm gonna name this guy. In honor of one of my units in Final Fantasy Tactics. Geist. There, Link. Yank. I mean, Geist. Assassin. Oh, shoot. I already have an assassin character. Oh, well, I'm just doing it to demonstrate. One more thing. This is Night Terror. Yep. That's the guy that... Who is the secret final boss. Let's play! Alright, so... Enjoy Terror's gaze for a few seconds while you still can, so... Yeah. That will do it for tonight's stream, and unlike the other previous stream, I'm gonna go switch to another game the next stream, so yeah. So that I won't go overboard, so yeah. I will see you guys next stream. Oh, and she's got something to say. 
think she has something to say. Oh, I want that bun. Give it to me. 